Can you remember a season in your family when everyone got something new to wear? Maybe a special outfit for Easter or Christmas or back to school clothes. And can you remember cleaning out your closet to hand down or donate the items that no longer fit or no longer work for your life? The role of clothes for humankind has been important ever since our original disobedience in the Garden of Eden. Suddenly, ashamed of our nakedness and need, humans hid, and God tenderly bent to make coverings for us. When the Apostle Paul writes to the church in Colossae about how to live out their identity in Jesus, he uses the metaphor of a new wardrobe. In chapter 3, verses 9 to 10, he talks about seeing ourselves as taking off our old self with its practices and putting on our new self, which is being renewed in the knowledge in the image of its creator. And then in verse 12, he says, clothe yourselves with compassion, kindness, humility, gentleness, and patience. No longer do we need to hide in embarrassment of our fallenness. God scoops us up and once again covers us with clothes of his own making, the love of his son given for us, the love he intended toward us in the beginning from which we once hid. And now he clothes us permanently, removing our shame by the sacrifice of his son. God has sewn us a new wardrobe to express who we've become in him. So let's go clean the unneeded, ill-fitting, and out-of-style garments from our closets, the practices that represent who we used to be without God. And let's clothe ourselves in outfits of his making, his characteristics, so that others will notice what God has done in our hearts.